Whether it is the way I met you or not, you must leave my house today. Who says we? You, you, you must leave my house today. No, 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 don't I'm not going anywhere. The stupid advice of your friends will not work today. I am not going anywhere. Look, even though Nago has revealed to me that you are a witch, you must leave my house today. Yeah, what are you? You have your own food. Are you like other men? Uh, I, I am not like other men. But you see, I am tired of living with a woman that will continue to eat my unborn children. That is why you are childless. Leave my house. My own is in. What's the matter? What's the matter? Uh, you have become the chief wife of the village. I will do it again. Look, I, I am tired again. of this marriage. I am tired. Before I used to think that my not progressing is as a result of ill luck or what. But I never knew. No one could reveal to me, do you believe, that my wife is a witch? So she must leave my house today. That is what I have become now. Yes. No problem. I will leave. But one day you will come back even to me. Me? No back to me. No, 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 of course, huh? go and get your wife back. What are you saying? I said, go and get your wife back. Tell me, what are you seeing? What is it? I see a tree, a tall tree, full of leaves, but not a single fruit. Surrounding it are dead fruits that fell beneath, all dry and very much dead. Onago. Please, please, I, I, I think you speak in deep riddles. Can you please speak in a language that I can understand? Mm. <clears throat> in the Marine Kingdom, you are married to a princess. And uh, she loves you so much. Has had 17 children for you. In the Marine Kingdom. Yes. What are you talking about? Olago, please don't think this is a, 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 a matter of jokes. I am serious. I have come to you with pain in my heart. Please don't add to my problems by making all this uh, jest and... Uh, you have given her all the children you are supposed to have on earth. And her love for you will not allow you to father a child by any woman on earth. There is nothing, absolutely nothing you can do about it. So are you saying that I cannot sleep with my wife? And I cannot make my wife pregnant. You can sleep with your wife, but you cannot make her pregnant. Destiny cannot be changed. So it is, and so it shall always be. Stop fooling yourself and go to the city for a check. And I say I'm not going to waste my money in the hands of those dupes that call themselves doctors. The fact that you grew up and lived all your life in the village does not mean that modern science doesn't work. I am not interested in your tricks. Onago is more reliable and he has told me what I need to know. Akudo is no longer my wife. You must be mad to send your wife away the second time over such barbaric issues. Call it whatever you like. The fact remains that there's no point she's staying with me here, calling herself my wife when she cannot give me a child. How many women are you going to divorce before you take yourself in for a test? Equazo, don't you know you are tormenting that innocent woman? Uh -huh. Innocent you call her? Uh, hey, look, get ready to explain what you have with Akudo that makes you, each time I raise a complaint about her, you will defend. 
Do you know the implication of the rubbish you are vomiting from your mouth? I know. I know. No, I what is it? I will tell you what the problem is. I have decided to divorce you and send you back to your parents. This marriage is over. What? Send for you. What do you want me to do? To kill myself? Come, are you not satisfied yet? Now you have taken my wife. Are you happy? You must be ashamed saying such rubbish to your own brother. It is you that should be ashamed of yourself. Listen. Your wife took ill. She was taken to the hospital. The doctor has confirmed she is pregnant. You should go and see your wife. What? Who is pregnant? I could do your wife. He's pregnant. <laughs> okay, well, you must think I'm a fool, eh? Who got Akudo pregnant? What sort of question is that? Behold, Okibo. Your evil has found you out. Ever since I married Akudo, she has not been able to give me a child. Now that I've sent her back in, you cornered her. And here you are, telling me that Akudo, your wife, is pregnant. What are you trying to say? That you got Akudo pregnant, Okibo. And that everybody in this community will hear about it. Ekwaza! 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 You should be ashamed of yourself, Ekwe. Why should I be ashamed of myself? No, tell me. It is you that is supposed to be ashamed of yourself. Look, Okibo. If you know that you are not responsible for my wife's pregnancy, go ahead and swear for me. Simple. Okay, I swear. I swear by our family and all the deities of our land. If I'm responsible for Akudo's pregnancy, may I sleep and never wake up. But if not, Ekwe, you will never see happiness again in your life. The day you shall set eyes on the child Akudo your wife carries in her womb, you shall die. That's good. After all, on our go, we are short. So we shall see. We shall see nothing. As old as you are, you are not ashamed of yourself. Imagine a fool who should, who should have been happy and thanking God for the wonderful gift. You are running around the village, disgracing yourself. I sense sadness in you. What is your worry? Onago, huh? do you know that my wife Akudu is pregnant? What? How? When? <laughs> I don't know. I should be asking you this question. How? In my mind, however, I suspect my brother. Exactly. You are not responsible. Huh? How? How dare your wife? 
commit this treacherous act against you. He, but my brother denied it all. What? Is he okay? But my brother denied it all. Even when I have found the two of them together several times. Hey! Each time Akudo cries in my house, she will find a caring shoulder in Okibo, my brother's house. And now she is pregnant. What a shame! A disgrace that will live with you forever. A curse about to dwell with you forever. That you shall live with a child that is not yours. Anago, hmm? what will I do? But my brother vehemently denied it. See, now he has walked into my trap. I want to expose him. I want to expose him. Please help me expose him and his nefarious acts. And I will. You're welcome. You're welcome. Thank you. Look, what I am telling you people is the truth, and that is what I know. Ever since Okibo started running around my wife Akudo, I have always suspected that something terrible will come out of it. Yes, I have always said it. I have always said it. That the way I see Akudo and Okibo move around these days, I have always believed what he said. No wonder the other day I saw both of them at the bush patch. Immediately they saw me to this part. Oh. Yeah. 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 What else are we looking um, for? Hey, uh, are you sure that what you are telling us is the truth? Because your late brother Okibo is a man that cared about you and have always acted for your interest. <laughs> Elders, uh -huh. somebody was accused the day before yesterday. Yesterday, he died. Oh. Yes. Look, how do you reconcile this? You came here. Yes, that is true. And he was a very strong man. Yes. What else are we looking for? The truth is there. Nzewakwe is against my interest. No, 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 Regarding her pregnancy, murdered Okibo through witchcraft. Yes. Another point. Another point. Another point. Yes. Another point. You see? Yes. And that is what I'm telling you. That Akodo killed Okibo to so as to make sure that the truth does not come out yes. regarding her pregnancy. Yes. That, that is that is it. Yes. That is true. 
you remember, mm. Okibo was never sick. What are we looking for? What are we talking about? What has my life become? In my dream, I see children calling me father. If I open my arm to embrace them, they will cry and disappear. I was a fool to listen and believe on Ago. Now, Akuda, my wife, has come carrying my baby. Will I ever see her again? God, where will I start from? I wish I never sent her back. Wait 
Something happened now. Please, allow me to lie down here. Ah, no, madam. People wait to get this close, they know agree. I beg, I beg, I beg. Please. I don't have anywhere to go. Madam, not be my fault. Please let me just lie down. Madam, I beg, no do this thing yet. No. Madam, you won't come out me for work. I beef then come out me now, you go give me another one. Madam, I beg, come go, I beg. Please. Madam, I beg, come go, no vex, I beg. I beg you. Madam, no vex, I beg. I beg you, I don't I have anywhere go to go. Madam, Madam, I beg, come go. Madam. <laughs> She's perfectly okay. Are you one of her relatives? No, she lives in one of the uncompleted buildings around us. Make sure you look for one of our relatives. She just had a set of twins. Two bouncing baby boys. Hey! Thank God! Thank God! Thank God! Mana could fall down from heaven for us. Mama, why is it that people don't want to help us? Are we going to remain like this? Yes, Mama, yesterday's own was worst. Okay, what is going to happen is this. Both of you use that 20 naira to buy something to eat. Maybe bread, 10 naira, and pure water. No, Mama. Mama, you are the one that should eat. The last time he ate something yesterday was uh, yesterday's afternoon. Good. My children. Both of you are more important. I no. can endure. No, Mama. Mama, you are more important. We can manage. We can easily go out there and eat from anywhere. Hmm? Any place we see anything, we eat and be satisfied. Yes, Mama. Mama, yes. there's something I want to tell you. What is it? I and Uzoma have just discussed it. We want to stop this begging. What do you mean? Mama, what we mean is that this thing is becoming very, very embarrassing. And it, it always puts us to shame whenever we see some other children passing us by. What are we going to do? How are we going to manage? We don't have anything. Where did you get all this money from? Mama, you have been saving from the little money you gave us every, you give us every day to eat food. Yes, Mama. We were hoping that one day we will use it and throw ourselves in, in primary school. Yes, Mama. At least to start from where we start. Or even use it and buy clothes for you and for us. Yes. Oh, God. Mama. Mama, the way it is now, I think we should forget about begging. 
I start a new business. Okay. Okay, like, what sort of business are you people talking about? Um, more like roasting of plantain, that is volleyball, and yes, with um, yam and corn, and even with granite, because people like to eat these things, and they buy a lot from it. Oh, God. That's a wonderful idea. God. Thank you very much. We just started this business. We don't know about it. Sorry. If you don't give us 500 naira as final, I'll take your properties to the ah, council. Wait, 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 wait. Please, please. I don't have 500 naira now. Eh? What do you have? Here? I have about, I have about 100 naira. I have about 100 naira. Let me give you 100 naira, please. Oh, please. 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 husband sent me away. I have begged for food. I have begged for money. I have begged for forgiveness of sin I never committed. All to no avail. My children have suffered so much that they even starved themselves to save money. All that gone in a twinkle of an eye. 500 Naira. Where will I raise such money from? Where? Where? Hey. Ah. Mama, are you still crying? I thought you promised you would cry again. Mama, Mama, crying will never solve any of our problems. Brother, it will increase it. Stop crying, Mama. Mama, See you cry will make us to be weak. Hmm? Mama, we're still young children, eh? Tomorrow will be better. Please stop crying. Please, Mama. I won't cry again. Just that anytime I remember what you children went through to save that money, it makes me feel so sad. Mama, will you understand? Hmm? Mama, we're, we're going to raise that money from tomorrow, eh? No matter what. Go, yeah, now your house. Good afternoon, sir. Please, I just got a message that my children are here. 
You are the mother of those two thieves, eh? No, they are not thieves. Ah. Go, go, go inside and then inside. Thank Let's you. Go. Maybe you are the one sending them to go and steal. No, officer. They are not criminals. They are my children. So please, whatever they have done, please release them and take me instead. They are not criminals. How can you say that? Eh? Do you know how many clothes that have vanished ar around my area? Eh? Ah, uh, sir, so, let me see. Woman, this is the clothes your children are selling. You see, it says that these clothes are okay. Now, why they are not? They are not. Officer, oh God, these clothes are not stolen. They are their clothes, officer. I allow them to sell it. They are not stolen. Their own clothes? Yes. You allow them to sell their own clothes? What for? Officer, you won't understand. It's a long story. I am a widow. I don't have anything to take care of these children. We used to walk around in the motor park begging for arms. These children starved themselves to save money for us to start up a business along the roadside. We were selling plantain, this that one. Just two days ago, the local permit officers came to carry everything we have because we don't have money to pay for the permit. Officer. <laughs> what does that consign with this clothes? That's a question. Uh, so they decide to sell it to raise money for us to pay for the credit so that we can go back to our business. Um, officer, allow them to go. Oh God, thank you. Let them have their clothes back. Children are my strength. They are the life that I have left. It's all right. There's no problem. No, excuse me, one more thing. Just um, take this. Oh eh? no, no, no. Take it. You need it more than I do. Just take it, eh?
Can't you wait till tomorrow morning? Please come and sleep. No, Mama. We're not sleeping this night or any other night until you answer us. He's our father. Where is he? Is he dead or alive? Mama, if he's dead, who are his people? Where are we from? Mama, who are we? We need answers to these questions. Why are you children bringing up this again? Okay. I thought we have agreed not to talk about it. No, Mama. We do not fall from the sky. How can we be suffering when we have a father? Even if you cannot help us, let us know who our father is. I have told myself never to bother you people with my unfortunate marriage to your father. Your father accused me of being responsible for his childlessness. He threw me out of his house. I was pregnant then. I sneaked into a timber lorry at night and followed it to the city. I couldn't go back to my people because they are disappointed and annoyed with me for marrying your father against their wish. God. Then, Mama, what is he now? We want to see him. Yes, Mama. He's at the village. Watch a village for Mama Uncle State. His name is It was a Ojiako. Ojiako, yes. But I don't want you people to go to him. He may not accept you people as his children. Good. Mama, how do you get to him? Ziba Road. See you over here. Yes, Mama. The place is it far from here? Yes, it's far. It's my road. Yes, Mama. Can we go tomorrow? No. I'm afraid he may not accept you as his children. He may not accept you as his children. Please stop crying and put to bed, okay? He may not accept you as his children. <laughs> For long now. The place has stopped. 
Let's take him to the hospital. Hospital? No. The charges will be too much. Don't worry, it's going to be alright. It's going to be My oldest dad didn't mean to hurt him. I was trying to pull out one plant and... Ah, uh, Hannah, you shouldn't go on blaming yourself. I told you it's not your fault. Eh? It was just an accident. Margaret, he has been like this since afternoon. He will be fine. He'll be okay. He'll be okay. Where are you going? To the market. Market? What market by this time of the night? Mama, we need money to take him to the hospital. Mama, those four, those nine one one people that are normally offload in the night. If I go down and work with them, please, before money, I will make them. Anna, sit down. Sit down, my son. Staying here and crying will not help patients. All you have to do now is to go out there and get to know your family relatives. 
your father or anybody. It is said that our mother will be alright very soon. Yes, that's exactly what we're trying to make sure of. But then we may need any of your family relatives to, to get something we need. Alright? Now hurry up then to work. What are you going to do? Who will you go? We don't know or have anybody. So, I don't know. We should go and find a man that gave us $2,000 the other day. Let me know whether he will help us. Maybe he will help us again. No problem, Mama. Mama, don't worry. Tomorrow will be better. Things will come. Money will come. Yes, but then we will have all we ever wanted in this world. For. Yes. And that time, Mama, hmm? that time you stand to point at whatever vehicle you want. You will have your driver. In the morning, like this, will just come out. You order a driver. Up on. Wash this tire. Have you washed the windscreen? Have you done this? Have you done that? You will be crossing. See, you old fool. You old illiterate. You don't want to wash yes, my car for me. Yes. Then you will balance at the owner's corner and be giving orders. Go left. Go right. Stop like this. Pop, 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 pop. Stop. Wait, wait. Let me say hello to my friend. Mr. Kunko, where are you? Have you prepared my salad? <laughs> Just that immediately. Oh, that I said, you even get um, yes. GSM. <laughs> Are you even use on copper? Okay, okay, I promise. Uh, don't I, cry won't cry yeah, I, I won't cry again. Yeah, stop crying. Please don't just cry again. I won't. Sorry. <laughs> Thank cry. you. Cry. I won't cry again, okay. I promise. Don't cry again. Yeah. All right. Yes, Mama. Thank don't you very much. We'll make you happy. I won't cry again. Anything we have, we'll just give it to you. I promise. Eh? Sorry, we all tried our best, but she gave up. 